range. I need a medic. Let's go. Ain't nothing a doctor can do for you now. Give you a chance to think about how weird you're acting. Now try not to fall off. Let's go. <laughs> Mother Superior, I think I have a test case for you. Senor Barstón, you're a true pilgrim. That I ain't. Hmm. Now let's see. <laughs> well, it certainly isn't a fluke. Their eyes are so devoid of love, of, of anything. <laughs> oh, lively one I see. Here. What is that? Holy water. <laughs> I think we may have something. It seems to be working. Maybe. Maybe not. But it seems as if you were nearly saved. Spiritual infections are confusing things, Senor Marston. None of us can hope to understand them properly. But he came back for a minute. I bless the water, but perhaps my faith is not that strong. I have to do more thinking, but I need time. Every day, more of my people fall as the dead rise in Sepulcro. Then perhaps it's time I put them to rest. Take the holy water. Maybe it will be a calming balm for the restless departed. Thank you. No, thank you. You are a blessing in an unusual form.
I looted you the first time you died. Go! 
Qué bueno, Señor Marston. How wonderful to see you alive. I think I've cleared Sepulcro. You're a brave servant of righteousness. I've been called many things in my time, but never that. <laughs> Who is that girl, by the way? She? I don't know. She said she was in a holy order in Escalera. I'm sure I keep seeing her. Or someone like her. Maybe. But it is a common enough look. Seemed like a nice girl. She told me something interesting. What's that? She blamed this terrible curse on our soon-to-be president, Abraham Reyes. Perhaps you have heard of him. Heard of him? I know him well. I hope that vain, ambitious, and repugnant parasite is no friend of yours. Not exactly. I didn't think he was that bad. And who am I to judge? Forgive me. I have just heard many unpleasant stories and met too many pregnant and abandoned girls. Of course. But what has he done? She claimed he had angered an ancient goddess, disturbed a crypt and a temple in her honor. <laughs> I mean, as I say it, it sounds like heresy, like the idiotic delusions of a cursed people. But in a land such as this, I have learned to be less dogmatic than maybe I have been instructed. I am sure it is just folly. Perhaps. But maybe it's time I go pay El President a visit anyway. I shall pray for you. Someone certainly needs to. Goodbye, Mother Superior. Vaya con Dios, mijo.
Senora, donde, donde is Abraham Reyes? He always did have a way with the ladies. <laughs> it's okay. He's dead. Thank you, senor. You'll be okay. I'm glad you think so. But I fear I won't. None of us will. We are all doomed. Because of him. Him? He wasn't a great guy, but I'm afraid you're giving him a little too much credit, my dear. Haven't I seen you before? No. He, he... He caused this with his greed and his lust for power. He heard an ancient myth and tested it. It caused all of these terrible things. His vanity overwhelmed us all. What the hell are you talking about? Where have I seen you? Uh, me? Oh, I have a common enough face. I'm from here. He disturbed the royal burial grounds that lie underneath the town. He heard there was a mask hidden there that would make him invincible. I've heard this blamed on Mexicans, Jewish people, freed slaves, the federal government, immigrants, the bad weather. Now this. What's wrong with people? It's true. Look in that chest. He has a sacred mask. That is where this plague came from. Him and his awful lust for power. Where did you say the crypt was? Near the bullfighting ring, behind the via. Well, I guess it's worth a shot. Turn the mask to the altar and end all this. Wait here. It's too dangerous. You need me. I know you need me. I sure hope you're right. Stay dead, please! Nature has been poisoned by that man's greed. 
I always told my son, never go into dark places with strangers. The presidential palace should never have been built above a sacred place. Harmony is fragile. The greatest catastrophes occur when you men try to play God. attacking you. You really are a strange girl. Many of these died in a great battle on this very no wonder they don't seem to like me. Think of your family. You must not keep up now. is all in the mind. 
must be returned to its rightful owner. Turn the mask. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. How do you know? My name is Ayotioto. Ayotioto. A horse is waiting for you. You should return home. trouble starts, I can pretty much guarantee you'll ride off into the sunset. You feeling better? Yes. I mean, once that boy stopped trying to bite me, everything felt much better. I'm starving, though. Jack? Uh, me? Oh, well, I only felt better once that mad look left your eye. Please, Dad, don't leave me here alone with that woman again. Uh, excuse me? 
I'll try not to, son. Uh, I've heard that before. Uh. Well, let me fix us something to eat. Please don't. We've had enough dramatics for one day.
Thank you for bringing Adrienne back alive. <laughs> I tell you, the zombies go after the weak ones. They sense weakness. 